Lord, if there's anything that I've not given to you, if there's anything that I've not committed to you, God, I ask you to show me. God, I ask you to help me give it up to you so that I can find victory in you. I give it up. I give it up to Jesus. I give it up to you, Lord. I give it up. Give it to you, Lord. Please touch me with sweet restoration. Lord, I give it up. I lay it down. I give it to you, Lord. I went through a battle. Where the sun didn't shine, it seemed like there was no sun there. Struggled to make it, seemed all of the time. God said, just let it go, give it all up, give it over to me. That's when I felt His sweet victory. You gotta give it up, give it up to Jesus. You just gotta give it up, give it to the Lord. He will touch you with sweet restoration if you give it up to the Lord. Sometimes we struggle. We pack that load up and we're going on our way. We're in control. And we have got it all worked out. Well, I tell you, that's famous last words. In today's world, that ain't going to work. That ain't going to cut it. You ain't going to make it if you don't give it all up to Him. As long as you've got something extra up there that you're packing along, you ain't going to make it. You ain't going to have the strength to make it. These times are kind of like a, a polishing thing. And it's kind of like a grinding wheel that gets down in there and grinds all the junk out of us. And we got to give it up to God. we got to give it up to Him. You can't do it by yourself. And you can't change yourself. You know, if you find that you're just sick and tired of yourself, the only way to do it is get on the altar. Get on your face before God. And, and let him break you. Let him break you. The best times I ever had was those times when he broke me. And I laid on my face and I said, God, I can't. I have nothing. And I've got so much junk in me. And God, I give it to you. And he cleaned me up. And he made me do. And then I gave him the battle. And I stood up and I found that victory in him. I give it up, I gave it up to Jesus. I gave it up, gave it to the Lord. And He touched me with sweet restoration when I gave it up, gave it to the Lord. Shackles and bondages, chains of defeat. Child of God, they were not made for you, you see. Let go of that battle, trust in His love. Find that release and that peace that can only come from above. Gotta give it up, give it up to Jesus. Gotta give it to Him, give it up. Gotta give it to the Lord. He will touch you with sweet restoration and restore you, and He'll make you new again. You gotta give it up, you gotta give it up, you gotta give it up, gotta give it up, give it all up, gotta give it all up, all up 
to the Lord. You know, God don't mean us to be loaded down. That's not victory in Him. He made a way, said Jesus, so that we could be forgiven, so we could get this junk off of us, and we could rise up. You know, even the devil can't hold us down. The only thing that can get us down is us ourselves. If we choose all this mess instead of choosing God, He can't do anything about it. We got to let it go. If we're saying, I know God's wanting me to get rid of this. I, I, I know that He's wanting me to get rid of this attitude. Or I, want, I know that He's wanting me to stop doing this kind of mess. We might say, well, I know that God's wanting me to stop stop doing these things but I'm not willing I want to tell you something if you don't give up the sin that you have in your life then God cannot help you you tie God's hands it's time that you yield it all to God let him clean you up let him clean you out let him get rid of those things in your life but you've got to give it to him before he can take it Gotta get up, get up to Jesus. Oh, you gotta give it all up, give it all up, give it to the Lord. You gotta give it up, give it up, give it up. He'll touch you with sweet restoration. If you just give it all up, gotta give it all up. Give it all up. You got to give it all up to Him. I want to tell you something. We can hold on to ourselves. We can hold on to our pride. We can hold on to our seem right ways. You know, we can talk us talk ourselves into being okay. But you, you need to get down on your face before God and say, Oh God, this ain't working for me. God, I need you to do something. I, I, I give it to you, Lord. I, I can't make it. I can't make it like this. All this junk that I'm holding on to, show me what it is. And I tell you, when he shows you, you need to listen to him. You're not going to get it fixed if you don't yield it and listen to him. You know, some people, I want to tell you something. I was one of them. I was not going to do what anybody told me to do. I have been that way so long. And the only way that God was able to do a work in me was get he got me down so broke. I mean, he just let me have my little way, do my own little thing. Until I wrecked my life totally, I wrecked my mind, I wrecked my heart, I wrecked it all. And then when I was laying flat on my back like a pancake, the only place that I could look was either right straight down to hell or right straight up. And I praised God. I looked up. And he reached his hand down. He said, now, you ready to do it my way? Are you ready to give it to me? Are you ready to yield this mess in you? Oh, I had all, oh, I was making so many excuses for everything I was doing. That I, humans are good at that. But it didn't get me fixed. It got me down there flatter than a pancake. It's time to stop making excuses. It's time to start for real, letting God deal with your heart. It's time to scramble to get to that place. And you, you say, oh God. God, I'm sick and tired of me. Oh God, I I don't want this mess in my life anymore. God, I want you to, to be in control of me. I want you to be in control of who I am. I want you to be in control of my life. It ain't working my way. God, I give it to you. I give it all up. Lord, I give it all up to you.